Yeah! Wu Tang! <laughs> what? Yes! You don't even know it yet. You don't even know it, but you're about to be blessed in your life. You're about to be shepherded in the right direction. Your life is about to be changed substantially, all because you decided to tune in to the Serpa show on Monday morning. Oh my gosh. We've already got more reactions than we've ever had, Darren, in the first minute of the show. We're starting strong, bro. Thank you. Thank you for being with us today, brother. My pleasure. Thinking about my life, thinking about where we started, thinking about how we met, thinking about my career and where it started in real estate. And I feel like it's been in a lot of ways leading to this moment to announce that, holy crap, I pretty much just won the lottery. Come <laughs> back up. Just won the lotto. Everybody. It's okay to dance. We're the XP now, Darren. That's the big announcement. You're welcome. That's hilarious. Hey, Darren Campbell, welcome to EXP. Thank you. Thank you, Dave. Thank you. I'm super excited, brother. I'm super excited. Um, so tracing it back to how we met, to how yeah. where, where this all started. And I was thinking, yeah. did, we, did we meet at LabCo? But we actually met at the closing table. We met at the closing table mastermind, you know, a gathering of a bunch of high level real estate brokers and agents sharing ideas about how to grow, how to proliferate, how to prosper, how to help other people prosper, more importantly. And we put all our minds together and we had a wild weekend in Laguna, right? We had a fantastic weekend. I can tell you right now, the closing table and the the closing table is a fantastic mastermind. It is a closing table mastermind. Woo, it was fantastic. And one of the cool things that I, I tell people that people always forget about is that, um, goodness, let, let's find this the right way. I'm so excited that I can barely get my mind right right now. <laughs> table. We met at a mastermind. And where was the mastermind? What hotel was it at again? We were at the Ritz-Carlton Laguna Beach, California. The Ritz-Carlton. And look at, where, look at where we started. And now look at, look at where we started at the bottom. Now we're here, right? Started at the bottom. Now we're here. The funny thing is. Um, I, uh, I, I'm sitting there at the mastermind. I'm hearing all these great ideas. Um, I, there's all this energy in the room and all I kept thinking is who's the crazy dude in the baseball cap. <laughs> <laughs> and I got it on today, brother. I got my LA cap on today. That's a, uh, it's, Hey, it's how, how we tell everybody where we're from. And we're, we're, we're a couple of SoCal dudes now. That's it. Yep. That's it. I, mean, you know, I came from the mean streets of Chicago and ended up living here in paradise and, and being able to live my dreams, be able to cre create my dreams. And again, more importantly, help other people live their dreams. Brother, there it is right there. See, the yeah. big thing that we, we keep telling people, and this is where you and I really bonded, was uh, helping other people. Um, we're both fanatic about our obsession of helping other people because we both started, I don't like to say low, but we started from humble beginnings. Hey, humble beginnings, man. And there's nothing, nothing to be ashamed about because there's so many people. Most of the people are from humble places and humble beginnings. Most people out there. The, the thing is, there's just a bunch of us that are determined not to stay there. And there's a lot of people who feel like they got to dig out of that hole and don't know how. And the best thing I can do with my time that you do with your time is to be a person who provides some solutions to help people get out of that rut, to break the cycle, to not live the life that their parents and grandparents might have lived and then bust out, man. And we've been so fortunate to have some opportunities to show people how to do it. And that's, that's the biggest blessing of all. Great that I can do for me and I can do it now, but now that I got it figured out, here's what I always say, Dave. Success is not complete once you have achieved it. It then becomes your obligation to show those who might not have otherwise had the chance. Boom. There it is. And so, and that's one of the reasons why I got my, my Lance Corporal pin on today. I'm a Marine Corps veteran. You're a, you know, you're a veteran of Chicago, brother. And that's you right. went through LA. And so um, the thing is, is we both love helping people. 
And that's what really brought us together is I came to you and I said, how can we help more people? What can we do? And you had this really fantastic um, idea at the time, which now has come to fruition. Yes. The seven yes. figure syndicator. Yes. Millionaire mindsets, right? Yes. So let's talk a little bit about that now that, and that's, that's where you and I kind of rekindled our relationship here recently. Um, what is a millionaire mindset from somebody that started from the bottom, that started from Chicago, got through Los Angeles and you were in Los Angeles during a rough time as well. Uh, yeah. and now you're in Venice beach. Yeah. And, and we're not even going to talk about where we're, where we're headed. We're going to get there in a minute because oh, yeah. right now this is about blessing people in their life. This is about bringing them something of value. Letting yeah. them know, like I came to you and I said, hey, I've got something of value. And it, that wasn't even why we met. No. We're talking about coaching. And so what is a millionaire mindset and how is it different than your, than your six-figure mindset? Well, a millionaire mindset is really, <clears throat> it's about belief. It's about a faith that you, that you grow to obtain. And you see a lot of people. And, you know, I borrow a lot from T. Harv Eker because he's a, he's a big influence on me. But he talks about your money blueprint. Right. And yeah. a lot of people have a money blueprint that spells defeat, that spells poverty, that spells strife, yeah. that spells struggle. And the funny thing is money and wealth is fluid. It's out there. It's just like floating around in the ethos and you can reach up and grab it. All you have to do is know how. And the trick is 90 plus percent of the people just don't know how. And so my job, my mission in life, what I've been put here for yeah. is to draw a roadmap and paint a blueprint for people to help them get out of the rut, Dave. Brother, I love you so much. One of the reasons why I, I became so successful was um, I got really good at helping single mothers become six-figure earners. And so it, and it was one of those things because I grew up raised by a single mother that it was naturally an energy that I, people flocked to me and I helped them out. And then, but they are the kind of people that they, because they have the reason, the reason why they can go from being a single mom to somebody who's consistently a six figure earner is because they have that mindset of, I have to do this for my kids. So they have a compelling why. And you can't give someone a why you can't hand some, someone a why you either cultivate your why or you don't cultivate it. But right. That's something that I was good at, but you, my, you also are very good at helping cultivate wealth. You've helped. You were at one point the number two agent in the world. Yeah, crazy, right? Smokes. <laughs> I had, I like, I knew that you were a big deal when I met you, and I've known every day since. But you were the number two agent in the world in two thousand and six. So, yeah. how how did you get there? From um, first off, how did you get? to UCLA. Tell us a little bit of your backstory because the number two agent in the world, it doesn't happen overnight. Exactly. Well, I'll tell you this, you know, my family, my mom, my brother, my sister, and I moved to California from Chicago, just seeking a new start. There was a, a divorce. My parents split. We mm -hmm. said, we, we, we got to get a fresh start. Chicago, it was a tough place to, to live for a number of reasons, but more importantly, we wanted to clean the slate, wipe the slate clean, start fresh, and we had confidence. We came here with nothing, but we all had confidence that we could make something. We just needed a new environment to do it, uh, to, to, to reboot. So, yeah. so we get out here quickly. I realized, you know, I got to be my own man. I got to be self-sufficient. I'm 14 years old, and I decided, you know what? If I want the baseball cleats, if I want the, to play on the, on the team and pay the and pay the fee to be on the team, if I want clothes that are decent, I'm going to have to be responsible for me. So I started working when I was 14 years old in high school, 10th grade. But I said, you know, if, if I'm going to have it, I got to get it. And that's where a millionaire mindset really begins. You yes. stop with putting any onus on anybody else. You mm -hmm. take full responsibility for the for the life you live, for the beds you sleep in, and yeah. there are no excuses and there are no scapegoats and nobody else's fault for you being where you are other than yours because only you can change it. And yeah. so we are plagued in society with people who are pointing the finger. He didn't give me that and I didn't get that and the man did that to me and society did that to me and the yeah. president did that to me. And you know what? Nobody did anything to you. You have an opportunity, just like the guy that's making a billion dollars this year. You got the same opportunity. You got the same 24 hours. You put your pants on the same way, one leg at a time, as all of them. Yes, yes, yes. Like, and the thing is, is we all have, have that opportunity. I don't care where you started. 
That's your so what star story. That's what that was what happened to you. You know what I mean? It's yeah. not what's wrong. It's what happened. And so people start thinking, oh my gosh, all these things are wrong in my life. It's like, no, that's what happened in your life. Now that's move forward and take ownership of every single day moving forward. Catherine uh, McCoy says uh, that she's a, um, she said earlier, she said, congrats. She said uh, that she, people are saying that they, what did she say? That she was a single mom here. Um, I lost the, the, the thing here. Uh, people are saying that they love your energy. Congratulations. Um, love you, Darren. Hello, <laughs> all. Good morning, Tyrone. That's where we met. Of course, uh, Rosie is talking about um, closing table. that we met at the closing table. Um, yeah. So all about helping other people. Golden, we really got on about that as well. The thing is, is people are excited, Darren, and we're officially past that 10-minute that 10 minute point so we can talk about this here but um a single mom we want to help people that we saw in our lives that we were unable to help from a young age and yeah. so we see opportunity in helping people break these cycles and that is probably the winner comment for the day break the cycle it's not where you started it's where you're going so we met at lab coat we met at the ritz carlton which was fantastic and we started talking about the seven-figure syndicator. And so before we get um, too lost, I want to give you an opportunity to tell people, what is the seven-figure syndicator and how does it differ differentiate you? Or how is it different than every other coaching platform? Okay. Well, there's a couple of things. First, again, I believe that my highest and best use is in helping others get to where they want to go, whether they believe they can or not. So you know, on one, I want to help them find the belief, and then I want to give them the tools to actually to, to effectuate that. And so, you know, in my career, I started out selling real estate, and I became pretty good at it. But then I started realizing that there were like an elite few who were participating in the ownership game, and a big number of people who felt locked out, blocked out. They thought they were on the outside looking in. Ownership's not for me. I can't own. I can't invest. And I had to, I had to take some dynamite, Dave. I had to blow that thing up, right? Yeah. yeah. And so, How did so, you break in? Well, the, the, what I realized was that I was selling. I sold a lot of investment property, right? I became one of the top apartment building sellers in all of California, and yeah. and then I helped a lot of people buy investment homes, and then I helped a lot of people buy their first homes. But then what I realized when I looked at people who were doing more than average, people who were excelling and exceeding, those people weren't doing it alone. They weren't playing the Lone Ranger game. I would help a guy, I, you know, when I was a kid or when I was in, at UCLA, I'm looking at a, a 50 unit or 100 unit apartment complex or a big shopping center. And I'm going, well, what corporation owns that? Well, when I got a little bit more sophisticated, I found out that individuals own that. And then I figured out, well, where's a guy get $10 million to buy a, an apartment building like that? I find out that guy didn't get the 10 million by himself. He put some money together with some of his other buddies, and they bought the building together. Ding, ding, yeah. ding, ding, ding. I go, well, wait a minute. I can play that game. I know lots yeah. of people. I know a good deal when I see one. So why don't I invite some people to invest with me in a good opportunity? Lo and behold, sir, I'm raising more money than I know what to do with. People are like, oh, yeah, I want to invest. I want to invest. I just don't have time. I just don't have the know-how. Can I invest with you? Can I ride with you? Can I buy with you? Before you know it, I'm syndicating investment properties all over the country, right? Yes. And then I think, you know how many people don't know that this is how people do this? Many people yeah. don't know that that guy whose name is up at the top of the building is not the sole owner of that building. That's right. Hello. That's right. You don't all like people think, well, I can't get there because I don't have my own money to spend. And it's like, no, 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 no. Wait, wait. You don't have to spend the money. What do you have? You have value that you can offer. That's and right. what is your value? Your value is your knowledge. That's became an, an information hoarder. You became somebody that studied and that learned an algorithm and then learned that you can apply that algorithm again and again and again. So where did that take you? That took me to the idea that, wait a minute, I, I went around, I bought a bunch of apartment buildings. I, bought, I put a lot of investors in a lot of good things. And then I go, well, wait a minute. There's not that, that that's too much special about me. I could teach other regular people how to do this. And they could change their lives. They could change their fortune. They could change their trajectory. 
So I, I created a, a course called Seven Figure Syndicator. It teaches people how to assemble the capital to and, and how to have the expertise to identify a great opportunity. You assemble investors who want to ride with you on a good opportunity. You assemble and collect the information that makes you intelligent enough to explain what a good opportunity is. And guess what? People will line up to give you their money and invest with you. And that's what syndication is, putting together a, a partnership of individuals who want to invest in the type of thing that you are investing in and they ride along with you. So I have taught hundreds of people how to raise capital, buy income producing property with none of their own money, Dave. No money. This is the real no money down deal. It's the real no money down. It's not the smoke and mirrors. I'm not on late night infomercial trying to sell you my seminar. Yeah. I'm telling you how to buy real estate with none of your own capital. And what's so cool about this, and we're going to tell people about this really, this big, and guys, you're watching right now, Darren Campbell, the $4 billion man. He's personally sold $4 billion in real estate. He was in, the, he's in the top 1% in the world for 20 consecutive years. The number two agent in the world in 2006. I watched your video today with your announcement for moving to EXP. And we're going to talk about that here in a second. But I really, I want to give, I always want to give people a, a takeaway. And this is already going to be a mind blowing show. But what is, what are people's takeaway for investing without startup capital? The, the takeaway is that it is absolutely possible. It absolutely happens every day. I'm living testimony that a kid from Chicago with no money and a single parent can go, go on to own seven, eight, nine hundred apartment units at, at a time. And that there are many, many, many people who are interested in and playing in that arena with me. And so all, I decided I was gonna to share the information and teach some people how to become experts at delivering information to people and say, hey, would you be interested if I could deliver something like this? And people are like, oh my God. And that's it. That. I'm in. Finding the deal, finding what's lucrative about it, and then becoming somebody who can present it enough times to enough people to get somebody to buy it. And a lot of uh, becoming an investor without having the startup capital is being willing to cast out that line and hearing yeah. no a thousand times and then getting that yes and then turning it into two yeses and then getting that initial yes and then turning it into 10 more. You need That's right. one yes. That's right. One yes to get started. That's right. It's not so, rocket science. And the funny thing is when you realize that you know, no blood was lost when somebody says no to you. Then you go, well, wait a minute, that didn't hurt so badly. Let me ask the next person. But well, here's the funny thing, Dave. Most of the people out there want to own real estate. Most of the people out there want to invest in real estate. They know it. Anybody who tells you they doesn't just probably doesn't know how to do it, or doesn't have the wherewithal. But everybody wants to own real estate. Real estate has yeah. created more wealth than any asset class in the history of planet Earth. So if you don't own some, you're on the outside looking in. My job was to pull back the curtain and let some more people peek in. And that's, 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 right. that's been my whole mission. And so the, what you're really doing is you're participating in wealth producing activities. And that's so it. one of the things that you tell people all the time is, is, is what is freedom, right? Right. Talk right. to me for a minute about freedom and, uh, and what that is. Okay. Well, I'll tell you about freedom. The, 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 the big idea about freedom is the ability to do as you please when you please. Now, Freedom, the freedom equation is not complete if you don't have money. Money, true freedom doesn't exist where there's not money. You might say freedom is happiness and freedom is health, and it is. But I'm telling you, freedom doesn't exist without wherewithal. And wherewithal equals money in this world. And the fact is, you, you cannot be truly free. And in my opinion, you cannot be truly happy without means, without money. And so... I, I contend, I, you know, I said this on somebody's show just recently. They say, hey, you know, money can't buy you happiness. But I say, but it's a hell of a down payment. The fact of the matter is money is critical to your happiness. And so you need to have it. And it's out there to be had, brother. There's this great weird Al song. And he says, uh, money can't money buy can't happiness. But I guess I'll have some money. <laughs> there you go. So that's, that's real. Here's the announcement. You are a millionaire, self-made, living in Venice Beach. This <laughs> dude with the beard comes up to you. We're talking about the seven-figure syndicator. We met at the closing table, and I came to talk to you about pitching your coaching platform. Mm -hmm. You, at that point, did not know about eXp or had not heard that much about eXp. 
What was it that you heard that was compelling enough to get you to choose EXP? Or at least get the conversation started. Let me tell you something. I have coached hundreds of real estate agents, Dave. And real estate agents many times live on this roller coaster, right? From deal to deal, they do well for, uh, you know, after they close the deal and then they struggle until they close the next. Mm -hmm. They fail to have a consistent income stream. They fail to have a consistent long-term plan. They fail to have a retirement mechanism in place. They fail to have ways that money can come in should they ever need or want to take an extended period of time off. That's in right. Real estate brokerage, it's usually if you don't show up, you can't get paid. Mm -hmm. EXP, you, my friend, blew my mind with EXP when you showed me the multiple ways that a person can grow wealth and achieve freedom. That magic number that we talked about, I mean, that magic term we talked about, which is freedom. See, EXP, now this is funny because I had just taken over a region for a major brokerage and I had just got an equity ownership in that region. And then like in my third week, you show up and tell me about EXP. I went back and quit. <laughs> I went That's back right. and quit, man, after like, 44 days on the uh, on the job, sold back the equity, quit the position and joined EXP. Why? Because I see a mechanism that will give real estate agents freedom like they've never tasted before. Now, I'll tell you this, look, the key to this whole thing is we, we sell real estate for a living. You, you will not, I will never stop selling real estate. It's what I do really, really well. However, however, by introducing this great opportunity to other people, EXP is brilliant enough to have figured out a way to share revenue with me that cost these people nothing out of their pockets. And yes. I, I introduce, if I show you a better mousetrap and you catch more mice and I get compensated for the mice you catch, everybody wins. So this is what we're going to do. We're going to have a moment because the thing is, is you and I are high D drivers, <laughs> right? No, nobody would be able to tell us that we are not high D drivers. We are two people that understand the value of hustle, understand the ability, the importance of systems and delegation and community masterminds. We push for the sake of pushing until we see a better way out. And we were both in situations where we were creating wealth for somebody else. We were creating wealth for other people. So why do two high, high D drivers decide to step into agent ownership together. And I'm gonna tell you right now, we are gonna shift massively away from all of the other talking about EXP. And, and I'm gonna tell you, look into what it costs to, to practice at EXP. 80-20 split, $16,000 cap, um, all these amazing things. Uh, there's no royalties. And you get to participate in um, revenue share. You get to participate and freaking stock and all these things, but let's put all this aside, brother. Mm -hmm. You and I, as two high D drivers that mm -hmm. understand a good thing and how to sell people a cloud brokerage, how to how to attract quality agents on something that can absolutely change their lives. What does the revenue share program mean for Darren Campbell? And why did you leave ownership at where you were before? And where have I turned down ownership at other places to experience? what EXP is. Okay, this is the mind boggling thing that most people don't understand. EXP has just piled on the benefits. Number one, an 80-20 split, great. We've heard about that, everybody goes, oh, no big deal, 80-20 split. Wait, let me tell you, 80-20 split with a $16,000 cap. You haven't seen that in very many places. That's right. You make 16 grand and you run on 100%. For me, that's gonna run, I'm gonna run on 100% for 11 months out of the year. Come on, who else is offering you that? That's right. Then, then in this, this opportunity to, to, to earn or buy company stock at a discount. You earn stock when you close and you can buy company stock at a discount. This company's traded on NASDAQ and it's gone from a dollar to $19 in about a year. <laughs> I was just gonna say, and where's the stock at now, brother? And it's- Hello, wish, wish I had bought it when it was 90 cents, man. Now, and then the next thing, and here's the most powerful thing of all, in my opinion. 
the opportunity to share this with other people that compounds your ability to make money when those people make deals gives you a passive income component, a retirement component, a wealth building component when you share a better opportunity with someone. So now wait a minute, if I can introduce you to a company that's gonna give you a better split and a lower cap and an opportunity to own their stock and an opportunity to earn passive income from the people you introduce to that opportunity and the fastest growing real estate brokerage company in the United States, yeah. What is the downside? I can't yeah. find it. <laughs> Missed it. The biggest thing is that people just don't know about it yet. And that's where the benefit comes in. Yeah, yeah it's early. It's day one. It is, it's, it's dawn on day one of EXP, which is why I'm trying to tell everyone I know who's in the business, who has a mindset that about achievement and freedom and retirement and wealth, I'm telling them about EXP. And today is day one for me. So I'm telling the world, this is my coming out party on the Surfer Show. I'm telling the world about EXP because it's the greatest money-making opportunity for a real estate professional that I have ever seen. And this is my 26th year, brother. I've been with five different brokerage companies. They've offered me profits. They've offered me profit share. They've offered me equity. They've offered me ownership. I've had all those things and revenue share dwarfs them all. Okay. I have owned, yeah. I've co-owned a brokerage with 400 agents in it. I have uh, been a, a major player at a company that said, hey, Darren, come over and we'll give you profit share. And I brought 40 some odd people with me. My profit share was this. And then, That's right. come on, bro. Profit share is a fantasy. You know what? Me and my accountant know how to make profit go to zero. And I guess they do too, because they, they didn't profit very much. Brother, so, so that is 100% it. When people talk about profit share, just like what you said, you and your accountant know how to make 100 to go to zero too. Come on, think about it. Think about it. The idea in the tax game is to profit as little as possible, write off as much as possible. So if a real estate broker, owner, operator, whatever you want to call him, has to do his books and then get to a profit number and then he'll share that with you, well, how lean do you think that number is going to be at the end of the day? But when a company says to you, we're going to do revenue share with you, not profit share, revenue share with you. Oh, and by the way, it's an agent owned organization. There's no CEO sitting at the top making $20 billion and giving us the crumbs. It's yes. an agent owned opportunity. We share the revenue together and they pass it back down. This is, this. I mean, check this out, bro. I gave up ownership in a regional franchise for a monster sized company owned by a mega, mega billionaire and I walked, brother. I walked away. Now, yeah. I mean, what does that tell you? What does that tell you? I That's saw right. something that I could not pass up. And what will happen here at EXP is I'm going to help a lot of people become millionaires. And guess what's going to happen to me in the meantime? We <laughs> see to the moon, baby. See, and, that, and that's one of the coolest things is we get an opportunity to help other people um, um, become millionaires. Millionaire. Yeah. Where else Think about that. that opportunity? Nowhere, nowhere. Where else is it in my best interest to make you a millionaire? Where else? You show me that place and I'll, you know, you, you, you will stagger me. EXP has created that opportunity for all of us and it is brilliant. And so here's what's going to happen. I'm going to introduce a better brokerage opportunity to a whole lot of people. And mm -hmm. those whole lot of people have Darren Campbell in their corner to go make as many millions as they can. And so I run this thing called the Wealthy Realtor Academy. That's my coaching business. And it's all about helping real estate agents become wealthy. It's all about helping real estate agents close more deals. It's about real estate agents making more things happen in their life as far as wealth is concerned. Now, guess what? If I can show you how to make the best split of any company you've ever been at with the lowest cap of any company that you've ever had, and you know, a lot of companies don't have caps. I mean, I was just recently at a company. They said, Darren, go hire people on a 70-30 with no cap. Are you joking? I felt bad every time. It's wild it. though, Darren. And really quick, if, if these things are sounding good, guys, you can absolutely contact Darren. I put his number in this video here, uh, above or below, depending on which format that you're watching on. Grace Santiago is another agent that uh, it, it works with me at XP. You can contact her. We we work together. Darren is. A, we're all a part of this massive mastermind online that is absolutely filled with some of the most amazing and incredibly talented people out there. And one of them is Grace. Another one is you. 
And uh, another one, is, and I'm trying to get, I'm going to get Leslie over here. Leslie, call up Darren. Call, call up. Guys, Darren listen. will call you. But the thing is, is what we're really doing is this isn't like a greasy thing. This isn't something that we're doing to try to manipulate everyone. What it's doing is, uh, and Rick is saying, make a plan to connect with 50 people every day. And the, the truth is, is he says, my kids will be the winner from the work that I do here today. And this is all great. And Christian also, who is on our team, you can contact Christian, another great dude. Um, uh, Lou, 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 I'm ready. Um, Brent Conley's watching. And guys, the people, if this should tell you right now, the quality of people that are watching right now are absolutely outstanding because we have a quality person here in front of you. So the thing is, is when you join EXP, you also get Darren Campbell, you get David Serpa, myself, Rosie, Rick, Brent, Gove, and we get to work for you. Now, this is what I want to do right now, brother. Okay. And we've kind of teased it here for a minute, but let's break down for people exactly how this rev share thing works because I think that right now the big thing is is people just don't understand they yeah. just don't get it and they don't want to take 20 minutes to, to look at Rob Flick's wealth chart video and see how they can make this kind of money but you're not talking about what are your goals here well my goals are you know I'm a little bit aggressive here but my objective here is uh, I'm gonna bring on hundred people in hundred days and and then what I'm going to do is I'm going to teach those 100 people. I got this little formula. I used the wealth chart to build it. But I'm going to show people how to introduce 10 people and a year from now have $350,000 in passive income because of that. And <laughs> 10 people and then a year from now, 350000 And And then what I want to do is I want to hear this. I want to hear the formula. I'm a formula addict. Yeah. I'm a math addict. And yeah. so for two high D drivers who are like, show me the numbers yeah. or it doesn't work. Yeah. Break it down for me, brother. Okay. Look, first of all, the EXP, EXP makes it possible because it's so generous. 80, 20 split, $16,000 cap. So what does that mean? Let's back that down into the reality. And you were selling the 70, 30 and everything. I was hiring people on a 70, 30 infinity cap, never cap. Right. Okay. So my, so listen to this, my half million dollar producers, we're giving $150,000 to the company. That same producer can come over to EXP and give the company $16,000 and keep the rest. Yeah. 150 versus 16, which is better in your pocket. Now, mm -hmm. let me tell you how, how my little formula works. And this is just the whole, the, the little Darren Campbell brainstorm. So this is formula for 350,000 passively. Yeah, 350,000 passively. All right. So again, I said it starts with EXP because EXP has been so generous with the commission arrangement. 80, 20, 16 cap. So if you do the math on that, that means you only have to earn $80,000 in gross commission income to cap. You get that? 20% of the 80,000 is 16 grand. So if you hit 80,000 in earnings, and, and let's face it, if we're not making 80 grand as real estate agents, we, we need to rethink our career. So that's right. 80, 20 on 80,000 bucks, you cap, now you're free, right? Okay. Now, all I say to people that I recruit is introduce me to 10 people you know that can make 80 grand in real estate. 80 grand. So introduce 80. you to 10 people, 10 that, people. That, can, that, can, that, are, that can make 100,000 or 80,000 a year in, in real estate. 80 grand. I mean, come on. I mean, Think about it. Everybody that's producing is making 80 or better. I mean, that's like all we're doing is right? making an introduction for you and make an introduction for me. I'm going to introduce them to the Wealthy Realtor Academy and I'm going to teach those people how to introduce 10 more people. And we're going to I'm going to show you how to introduce me to 10 and I'm going to take each of your people and show them how to introduce me to 10. And we're going to grow all of those people to the point where you have 110 people in your organization. And if you look at the wealth chart, and people need to study Rob Flick's wealth chart that you just held up, if you do just that, your income, your passive income, people, is three hundred forty-eight thousand dollars passive. Do you hear me? Three forty-eight passive. So, Dave, you know what I like to say in my in my seminars? I say speed it up and dumb it down. I just dumbed it down. Ten will get ten, and you got three hundred fifty grand. I will help people do that. You can reach out to me, Darren at DarrenCampbell.com, and I'll teach you how that happens. But in addition to that, Dave, here's the, here's the special layer on top. Most real estate agents have never truly been taught to sell. 
And our job is to sell real estate. And our job is to sell it more efficiently and more effectively. And that's part of my coaching concept is to teach people how to do more, do more deals in the real estate business and do it more fluidly and more consistently and more predictably. So if I can show you how to predictably make a quarter million and a half a million dollars in your practice, and then I can ask you to introduce me to 10 people who you think are capable of making 80 grand or more in their real estate practice, I can show you how to get to a half a million in your practice and get to another 348 in passive. I think that's a pretty decent living for most people. I think people can appreciate that. And it's not that hard to do. Um, okay. So. You're distracted. So, do, do, so <laughs> really the thing is, is like, do you make $80,000? Yeah, you make eighty thousand dollars, or you know ten people that make eighty thousand dollars, and if you don't make eighty thousand dollars right now in you this market coaching. in real estate, hey, you might hey. as well. Like people are like, wait, but David, I need accountability, and I don't know about the brick and, and I really need my this and that. If you cannot make eighty thousand dollars a year in this market, if you can't do that, just like you know, just call it in. You're you're you're, you're you don't belong here. So, but if you are make if you're one of those people that makes eighty thousand dollars plus a year, and if you know ten people that do the same, and you can just introduce them to Darren, you don't even have to make a single recruiting phone call or a tracking phone call, and you can make three hundred and fifty thousand dollars a year annually. And all these people have to do is cap. All yeah. they have to do is cap, which is yeah. what they're doing anyway. And it yeah. lasts. Yeah. And, and so, you know, all of the, all of the barriers, all the, all the bars are low, Dave. This is not, this doesn't have to be rocket science. You don't have to, you don't have to kill yourself in order to be okay in this business. This is about working smarter. And EXP has pre -cre created a platform for us to work smart and really benefit in a big way. I have to I tell everybody, go like, aren't you tired of making your broker rich? Isn't it your turn? Isn't it your turn? Your broker's getting rich. And you're not participating, but it's time for you to participate. It's time that you go with a with a, a heart-centered company that has decided that the agents come first. And if we make these agents affluent and we make these agents prosperous, then this organization will benefit. That's mm -hmm. called creating wealth from the top down. And say, like, let me give you an opportunity to better yourself, to become free financially. And then as a result, the whole will benefit. And I want to tell people really quick, and, and I'm going to explain this to everybody. I am somebody that in my career, and I didn't make a habit of it, unfortunately. I, I'm not as cool as Darren um, yet, but I'm working on it. Um, but Darren, you have consistently made over $100,000 a month easily. I made over $100,000 a month a few times. But the thing is, is I'm looking at how I will realistically be making over $100,000 in a month just on because I'm a math person. Look, I have I have Asperger's. I have a high IQ and I'm socially inept. But what happens is because of that, I'm extraordinarily honest and I am good with numbers. And when I break it down, I'm like dollars and cents. This makes sense. What do I have to do as a high D driver to, to make this happen? And the thing is, is it's a simple it's a simple equation. It's a simple equation and it's broken down here. But what you said is 100 people in 100 days. OK. Yeah. Uh, and, and this is for, and right now, I'm really, let's talk to our high drivers, okay? We okay. spoke to everybody, and, you know, you understand how you can make, you know, uh, several thousand dollars a month or whatnot uh, passively. And, and, and again, this is my opinion. These are, I'm not stating income. This is not EXP endorsing this and saying that this is whatnot. Uh, but the thing is, is just looking at the numbers on how this breaks down, all of this makes sense. But now I want to talk to, my fellow franchise owners, right? The Mike Bjorkmans of the world who sold off several franchises to join this. The Darren Campbells of the world who sold off, uh, who, who turned on ownership in another platform to come here. What, do, and what does that mean for you financially to recruit 100 people in 100 days? Why did you choose that number? Well, because, you know, I, I'm an aggressive guy. I, and if, and if, I know a lot of people. I've coached a lot of people. I have, um, uh, I've talked to, shown a lot of people, you know, kind of the better path. I've helped a lot of people learn how to close. I helped a lot of people learn how to capture appointments. And so I believe that 
simply by talking to a minimum of a person a day, I can show them very logically why this makes more sense than whatever they're doing. I mean, think about it. I, I got scores and scores and dozens and dozens it's of people out, out there on, on 75, 25s with no cap or, or on 80, 20s with a $30,000 cap or, and no opportunity to do anything as far as making money is concerned unless they go sell something. Here's the thing, here's the thing. People in this business, we're, we're independent contractors. So nine times out of 10, there is no money made if we don't go out and make some rain happen, right? Yeah, so this is an opportunity that I'm showing people. This is an opportunity to put something in place so that eventually you're making money, whether you go sell a piece of property or not. You see, That's right. this business is a struggle and it's a drain. And I think and at the end of the day, I want to coach you in a manner where you're taking two months off a year and still getting paid. You and see, when we say coaching, this day, it's as simple as this. You join EXP. You step into our Facebook group that we have online that has Mike Bjorkman in it, that has Rosie in it, that has all of Gray Santiago in it, that has David Golden in it, that has all of these people that I can't even mention their names yet because they're currently selling off franchises to be a part of this. And you can have an opportunity to mastermind with Darren. You can have an opportunity to mastermind with me. And it's an ongoing thing. But really breaking it down, 100 people in 100 days. So, you know, Dave, that's, that's super ambitious. I don't even want to give people that much heavy weight. I'm showing people how to how to introduce 10. Introduce 10. Introduce 10. You know, I, I'm, a, I'm an overachiever. I just run 100 miles an hour. So 100 people in 100 days, that's a lot. I'm going to dumb it way down. Introduce See, 10. Darren is a guy that manages expectations. And I'm a guy that says, pull that string back and shoot for the moon. Because <laughs> guess what? Do you know how many times that I failed to get where I am today? You know what I mean? Pull that string back and shoot for the moon. But if you want to manage expectations, it is. It's 10 people that you would introduce to Darren. And I will teach those 10 how to introduce 10. And before you know it, you will have a serious money-making leveraged opportunity in your lap. You see, because what I don't want people to do is quit and think, okay, I'm not going to sell real estate anymore. This whole thing is built on selling real estate. So what I okay. want to do is wanna, I want to keep people selling real estate. I want to help them sell it more efficiently and more effectively. But while you do that, let's check, check this out, Dave. This I'm month, real estate too, brother. Listen to this. In the month of October, I'll close nine or 10 or 12 deals with agents from other companies. The low-hanging fruit is this. After that transaction closes, I will go and talk to that agent and simply say, you know, the brokerage company I'm with is offering a special opportunity that I don't think is matched anywhere in the marketplace. Mm -hmm. Why don't you take a look at this video? And that person is going to look at that video and then they're going to do the math and they're going to realize that on that 100% that I'm at because I capped versus that 70, 30 that they're at it for infinity, Darren took home a whole lot more money on the same transaction than they did. And they're going to go, hey, brother, tell me a little bit more about that EXP thing. And that's, that's right. how this thing going to grow. You don't even have to know 10 people. Take everybody you close with in the next 120 days and simply introduce them to the opportunity. The logic speaks for itself. This thing sells itself, Dave. A it lot of people, itself. they look at this and they get overwhelmed. Yeah, like so I do. I look yeah. at it and I get, I get overwhelmed. You need 100 so people in 100 and It's as simple as this. Yeah. It's as simple as this. These are the levels you have. And I, maybe I'll do a wealth chart video. If you guys want me to do my own wealth chart video, maybe I'll do this. But yeah. you, you bring on five people, you have access to second level, 10 people, third level, 15 people, fourth level, et cetera. And then the financial amounts for each level are right here on the side. It's just broken down in black and white. If you want to watch Rob Flick's wealth chart video, this is exactly how it works. Rob Flick breaks it down for you. It is a little bit dry, but hey, make yourself a hot pocket and sit through it. <laughs> and uh, it, But the thing is, is for me with Darren, if Darren recruits 100 people, 100 people at $3,200 annually, to me, that's 320000 annually because I was willing to just introduce Darren to an opportunity that is an amazing opportunity. And that's it. It's just introducing somebody to an opportunity. That's it. It's fantastic real estate. 
It's a great opportunity. It's a lower cap. The cloud brokerage is phenomenal. The rev share program is phenomenal. The, uh, the I can't speak personally for the stock yet because I haven't started uh, experiencing that yet. But you are cur you are selling real estate. And it, what happens is that uh, that revenue, instead of getting sent to the big fat brick and mortar and a bunch of people that you never see anyway, that are all financially benefiting from you, you're, that money is going to the people that are also mentoring you online that you are engaged with. And wouldn't you want this guy to be one of your mentors? <laughs> well, that's what I want to do, man. Here's the thing. I want to help people grow their wealth. It's my mission. I, that's why I was put here, bro. I already know this. You know, I know my mission. My mission is to help other people obtain financial security and freedom. And that sharing benefits me. And I, so I can I do it selflessly. People say a couple of a couple of common questions. Well, how can they afford to give back that much money? Well, first thing, let me tell you, I just got through. I just turned in my ownership of a couple of offices where the rent is twenty thousand a month for those offices. And, you know, I sit right. in, I sat in my big fat owner manager's office with six thousand square feet of emptiness. People aren't yes. showing up at the office. So EXP, no brick and mortar, no 20,000 a month in rent. And you wonder yes. where the money comes from? Hello, you wonder why, hey, you wanna know why your profit share company ain't profitable? Cause they're paying 30 grand a month in rent times 10. Hello, they're broke brother, they're broke. <laughs> EXP rents no offices. EXP pays no rent. EXP <laughs> shares revenue that comes in from all of our 80-20 splits, redistributes it to us and allows us to participate as owners. Guess what? You're, yes. not a, you're not a minion coming to check in and to some big empty ass office where they're paying 20 grand a month in rent. They wanted me to hire more people at 70, 30 so they could pay the 20 grand a month in rent, bro. That's, That's right. Over. That game is over. That game That's is right. dead. That's right. The game is changing. And, and the thing is, is what's absolutely wild about this is that the market, it's already starting to shift and it's going to shift into a buyer's market. But what that means is it like they think that they're going to need to keep attracting these puppy mills to keep them around. But the thing is, is teams are now teams in individual agents that are islands that have like their TC that they work with. Those are the people that are now going to be controlling the market going forward. Not these big fat brokerages. People don't care about the big realogy stamp that says, I'm worth money. I know how to practice real estate because you've been building your name and your brand and your community this entire time. Keep that going. You should be the one that's profiting, not somebody else. So people are absolutely buzzing right now online. If you guys have questions, make sure that you fire them away and we'll see if we can get a couple of them uh, ironed out. But keep it going. You touched on a hot point. Okay, I yeah. recently got offered ownership opportunities, two different places. I took one, as you know, and stayed for 44 days. But I took, the two of them offered this, but part of, I, mean, I read their bylaws and their guidelines, and here's a big one. Here's a big one. You must use our colors. You must use our name. You must use our brand. Any deviation from this results in a fine or expulsion from the company. Now, wait a minute. I thought I worked for myself, but they're going to fire me if the color is purple instead of burgundy. The beautiful thing about EXP is it allows you to maintain your identity, maintain your brand, fly your flag and be you and continue to prosper and build yourself. You see, here's a company that cares about you, the agent. They're not so worried about, hey, you're tainting our national brand and our yeah. mega billionaire owner is gonna get mad and gonna slap you on the wrist. No, EXP wants you to proliferate. They want you to prosper. So I can be Darren Campbell Inc. Yes. Damn it, and continue to roll, Dave. I can continue to roll, powered by EXP. Now I'm Darren Campbell, powered by EXP. Guess what, my clients go, congratulations, keep rolling, DC. That's right. That's right. That's right. Your clients who love you, who know, like, and trust you, who want to do business with Darren Campbell are yeah. saying to the world, they're saying, they're, they're saying to you, they're saying, Hey, Darren Campbell, good job. Congratulations. I received nothing but congratulations from my clients. Right. People can say, what, what's EXP? You know what I did happen was I had two past clients that also had gotten their real estate license who called me up and said, Hey man, I'm thinking about joining EXP. <laughs> and one of them's already here. So the thing is, is people understand an opportunity like this just in being involved in the Amazon or the Netflix that is going to be putting Blockbuster out of business. What if That's Netflix crazy. burst in your front door right now and said, hey, you get an opportunity to invest in Netflix 10 years ago. 
you would be going, oh, my goodness gracious, sign me up. I love Netflix. There you go. That's what's happening right now. Somebody has hopped into a DeLorean. That, <laughs> that person being Darren Campbell, he's hopped into his DeLorean. He's hopped back into the past, and he's telling you right now, you have an opportunity as an agent owner to get involved in EXP, and it's absolutely fantastic. Sonia says EXP is for us. That's right. Financial freedom is music to my ears. People are already saying, sign me up. Uh, Grace is saying, Serpa, you should do a video on the wealth chart. It would be fantastic. I really think I'm going to. I think I'm going to do a wealth chart video. I think I'm probably going to do it this week. Um, you should, the thing is, the, the, the you know, a fair playing field, that's exactly right. That's because Catherine McCoy is saying. The fact of the matter is, it is finally a fair playing field. It, it is finally a, an equitable sharing between the broker and the agents. The agents make the rain happen. We're the ones who got in this business to find financial freedom. And it shouldn't. you shouldn't be getting raped and pillaged by your broker. You that's right. You know, the brokers are sitting around getting fat off of your hustle. It's time that you got paid. Aren't you tired of making your broker rich? It's time you became rich. It's time you became wealthy. It's time that you looked out for you and had a mechanism that gave you long lasting, extended income possibilities that go beyond the, the transactional day to day. I mean, you look, you close your last deal and suddenly you're out of business. Now you're worried about where your next deal is going to come from. If you build the right machine, if you put the right things in place with EXP, you'll get paid every month regardless of whether you close a transaction or not. And no one else has offered that. No one else has offered it like this. No one else has shared more of the wealth than this. And that's why I immediately came home from that meeting with you guys and said, I'm out. I got to make a move. I'm going to EXP, baby. Yep. Yeah. And, and the thing is, is like at the end of the day, and, and I just put it for everybody, fat brokers. The thing is, is you're either getting your family paid, you're either making your family money or you're making somebody else money every day. Every day that you wake up, you are either going to be, waking up and working for you or you're working for somebody else. And all that we're saying is take a look at this opportunity. Talk to Darren. Talk to Darren. Just have a conversation with Darren. You can message Darren right now, and I guarantee you, you'll probably have a, a response by the end of the day because Darren's that kind of dude, unlike me, who will make you wait, and I'll talk to you when I'm feeling inspired, which is why I'm not going to attract 100 people to EXP in 100 days. I'll get, I'll get 20 people in 100 days, but Darren, you're, you're the kind of guy that you're going to shatter records. You're going to make yourself an ex extraordinary amount of money, but you're also going to set people up for retirement. And can we really quick... Can we, and this is one of the things that David Golden talks to me about, which is such a cool thing. He talks about throwing retirement parties. <laughs> I like that. I like it too. And we talk about it. Hey, and, and realistically, Darren, you're the kind of guy that you could be throwing your own retirement party in 100 days, but you're not going to stop in 100 days because this is an opportunity that we get an opportunity to pass on to other people, to make other people their own, uh, not just their own island, but we have a tribe of people that we have online that we network with, that we talk to. And you came out and you hung out with us uh, at this recent speaking event, which thank you for doing that. And uh, and you said, you said, I like you guys. I want to hang out with you guys. This is a good group. And you came to Vegas and, uh, and you went out and you met everybody. And what were your thoughts on the EXP crew? You know what the funny thing is? It's the first time I've been around a, a group of like-minded people who all had each other's best interest in mind. Everybody that I met, was busy trying to help each other grow their their businesses. So, you know, and the funny thing is I got into coaching after I had, you know, I think it was a close to two and a half billion dollars. And, and I decided, you know, I was running this company and we did these weekly workshops and yeah. the workshops were packed because people were, were thirsty for, for the knowledge to do yeah. better. And so I decided to start coaching because people really wanted to do better for themselves and for their families. And the fact is most people, haven't been taught the best ways to accomplish at the highest levels. And, and then here we are with an organization with EXP that now gives me incentive and you incentive to help lots of other people achieve their goals. Now, hey, let me tell you this, Dave. Yes. I cannot tell you how many people I know that have been in this real estate business for more than 10 years and can't figure out how they'd ever retire. Now, think about that. Now, how many people do you know? Now, everybody on this, everybody on this webinar should think about this. Wait, did you say you're, we're talking retirement. We're talking just the idea of retirement. How many realtors do you know that can't even fathom the idea? 
of a comfortable retirement? How many realtors do you know that have to go out and sell another deal to survive the next six months to a year? Yes. How many realtors do you know that can't figure out at 65 or 70 or 75 how they're going to quit door yes. knocking and cold calling? You got to, you know, there's, I feel those people's pain and I want to help them overcome that pain. The day should oh, come when you don't have to yeah. door knock anymore, Dave. The day should come when you don't have to door knock anymore. We're like, we laugh about it, that there's this 55, 60 year old guy putting out open. Hey, you know what? But that's just the struggle. I'm still involved in it. I'm putting out my open house signs just like you are. And the thing is, is yes, do your 12 to 15 houses a year. That's what my new goal. I don't want to sell. like I sold over 150 homes a year with my team for three years in a row. Over 150 homes in a year. I'm a Marine Corps vet, man. I freaking, I know how to sweat it out in the trenches. But I saw EXP as an opportunity to become somebody that can sell 12 to 15 houses a year and enjoy my my family time and yeah. use that additional money to help subsidize the rest of my life so that I can enjoy it. Yeah. And so it's freeing me up. And so we're talking about people retiring, brother. Talk to me. I'm talking about the freedom to retire. You see, there's so many of us in this business. We're, we're independent contractors and we think the run will be forever. I'll just continue to sell more houses. And no one really builds a plan for us to say, hey, at what point do you want to stop door knocking? At what point do you want to stop doing open houses? At what point will you have the ability to stop cold calling? And no brokerage organization up until now has given us the mechanism to put that into place. Now, what if now, just what if you've been in this business 10 or 15 or 20 years and we showed you this little bitty plan that over the next three to five years, you could create something where you had five figure passive monthly income coming in so that you didn't have to door knock anymore. I listen, I know a few people. I mean, I was just recently the head of an organization where at least 15 people in the office were over the age of 60 and they had to show up or they wouldn't survive. Now, that's a plight that, you know, while a lot of people look at us as real estate agents, hey, you guys make a lot of money. Dave, 88% of real estate agents in the United States make less than $100,000. 88%. That's right. So there is no financial freedom for those people. Those people can't go, go off and go, out, go to Tahiti for a month. You know, a lot of people see the trappings that some of us at the very, very top get to enjoy, but 88% make less than 100 grand a year. So where's the retirement for them? When can they quit? When yes. can they quit? They can't. Mm -hmm. And so what EXP has done is created an opportunity for you to build a systematic way to get a predictable monthly passive income for the rest of your life. That's right. And, the, and what you said that was so important there, and, and, and I'm the kind of person that I'm like, listen, if somebody could do it in three to five years, I could do it in three to five months. But like, <laughs> that's me. But the thing is, is like for most people, realistically, in three to five years, we're all still pretty young. We're all still doing all right. And if in three to five years, you can introduce 10 people 10. over the course of three to five years to that's Dan 10. Campbell, you're going to set yourself up in, in addition to practicing real estate at a rate that's very agreeable with a company that's very respectable, that's publicly traded on the NASDAQ, EXPI, check it out, we're, we're publicly traded, check out these videos, check out this wealth chart. But the thing is, is what you said is, in three to five years, you can set yourself up for five figure passive monthly income. And you know, and see that's keeping it simple, Dave, because you know, a lot, of people, a lot of people might not be like me. You know, I want a seven-figure monthly income. And that's where, that's where I'm trying to go. But then, but sometimes that, that overwhelms people. And they go, well, I'm not Darren Campbell. Or I don't coach a thousand people. And I haven't made, had a $3 million a year. So, okay, so forget that. Do what you do already. And let's introduce 10 people to the opportunity. And then let me help you introduce, help you help those people introduce 10 more. And right. That's it. You bring 10 to the table. You join us and you bring 10 people to the table and I will actively help those people introduce 10 and I'll show you how to make that passive income. That's the goal here, Dave. That's the goal. Down that some freedom. For those of you that, that are just tuning in, you introduce 10 people to Darren. 10 people to Darren. You don't even have to make that, that phone call. Make the initial phone call. Hey, can my friend Darren call you up? That's it. Hey, that's it. And he, he, he's personally has been in the top 20 real estate agents in the world 
for over the last 20 years, or top 1% of uh, agents in the world for 20 consecutive years, number two agent in the world in 2006, sold $4 billion in real estate. This guy is as self-made as it gets, and all he wants to do is share an opportunity with you. Maybe it's as simple as sh uh, sharing out this video. Share this video out. Yeah. Tell them, hey, listen, if you, if you like this, if you are watching this video right now and you think, you know what, they, Darren helped me a lot in my life. Maybe you looked up the, the, the Rob Flick video after this. And maybe you're just feeling passionate about this video. All you have to do is share this video and say, contact me about this opportunity. Or, hey, what do you guys think about this? It seems like a pretty crazy deal. What is EXP? Because a lot of people right now are just hearing EXP for the first time. They've never even heard it before. You know what I mean? Reynaldo Jones says something very important. He says, change the mentality of being self-employed. Be the owner. Yes! <laughs> if you are still thinking of, in, in terms of self-employment, you're still thinking of yourself as an employee. Be an owner. That's own it. your business. If you don't own your business, someone else owns your business. You wake up going to work for someone else, setting up their retirement for their families. Um, you've been with me for a long time, Darren. I want to respect you. I uh, should self-employ, but, but a real one on the replay is DC uh, going to be posted. Pass this stuff out, guys. Tag people. Let people know. True, David. If you don't find a way to make money while you sleep, you'll work until you die. I want to let people know you've got a video that you are launching today. Yes. It's, this, just, it's the formal announcement that Darren C. Campbell has joined EXP Realty. And, 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 and with that, see, then that's the, in that in and of itself is just a thing. The $4 billion in closed transactions, that's just a thing. That doesn't mean anything to anybody else out there. That doesn't mean anybody else paid. And so what, I, what it really means for me is it's a sharing. I want to share an opportunity that I think is the greatest that you've ever seen in the real estate business. And so I'm about sharing this opportunity. And so this announcement, this video that's about to hit the airwaves, Darren Campbell, $4 billion, man, that's all great, but it doesn't mean anything unless it means something to you. And what, what I do, Dave, is I run this organization called the Wealthy Realtor Academy. And that's just my coaching business. And that's just about helping real estate agents maximize their opportunity to become financially free. And let's face it, we got in this business to find financial freedom. We didn't get into this business because we wanted to hustle for 40 years. We wanted to yeah. find financial freedom. And those of us that are in it know that's why we got in it. Those people who aren't in it, they have different objectives. But if you're in this business, you got in it to make a lot of money. And it's a yeah. shame if you're not making a lot of money. And what I try to do at the Wealthy Realtor Academy is I just try to teach you how to not be lame. Let me show you how to do this. This business is not <laughs> rocket science. Let's just not be lame. There's some things you can do, and I'm going to show you how to do them step by step by step by step so that you close more transactions. What if you close 12 extra transactions next year? How much more money would you have in your pocket? If you got one extra deal a month out of being associated with me and watching my videos and listening to my coaching tips, if you got one extra transaction a month, how would that affect your income? That's what I want to do for people. So that's why I built this coaching organization. But now, EXP has given me the opportunity to introduce all those coaching people to the greatest brokerage opportunity. Yes. So I, coach people, I coach people at Remax, Berkshire, Keller, Marcus and Millichap, all these companies. I coach people from all those companies. And the thing is, is when you and I got together, we got together as friends, brother. We were just breaking bread. We were hanging yeah. out and we were talking. You said, hey, man, I, I just joined this company. This is what happened. I'm going to recruit all these people. I said, how much are you going to get paid? What's going to happen? And for me, <laughs> I ask all the rude questions that right. normal people don't, uh, that people who are neuro neurotypical don't ask, but because I'm a little bit weird, I'm like, how much money are you going to make? How much ownership did they give you? And then I just said, hey, have you heard about EXP? And it was yeah. as simple as that. So people are asking, they said, uh, uh, let's post the link, share it, share the video. And so this video, we will post it in the comment section below. Um, we'll go ahead and post it as soon as it's live. Luana, uh, Luana is asking which Facebook page are we referring to? What we're talking to uh, talking about is the 52 crew. Basically, if you join EXP through anyone in my group of people, or if you're currently with EXP already and you want to come into our group, we already have some people like that. But if you're on, if you come on under Darren Campbell, you get added to the 52 crew and all that happens is it is a mastermind that is constantly happening that has all of the big names that have been surrounded through the closing table, 
through the Club Wealth Masterminds that I've been a part of, all of these national masterminds, these people that I've met through Lab Coat that are now with EXP. And so it, it just gives you an opportunity to be a part of that. Let me know if you want to be a part of that. We'll go ahead and we'll get you added as soon as you're with EXP. Preferably you join with Darren Campbell. Um, so uh, you said something that was really interesting in that video. You said there are three types of people <laughs> on um, – yeah. can you break it down for me? Yeah, well, you know, I say this in all my seminars and all my coaching classes, but there are really three types of people. that, And I say it in kind of a funny way because it is funny, but it's not. There's only three types of people. There are people who make things happen. There are people who watch things happen. And there are people who wake up and go, what happened? <laughs> and which one are you? The bottom line is the early joiners at EXP are people who are making things happen. That's yeah. right. There are a lot of people that we're telling about EXP who are going to watch things happen. And then there are going to people who, like most people fall. They fall in the watch. Yeah. Like they yeah. knew that there was an opportunity, but they were just they just kind of didn't want to do it. Well, because change is scary. Moving is scary. Yeah. You know, uh, changing your license over is scary. Leaving your comfort zone and your friends is scary. You know, what would the broker, what would my broker owner say? Oh, that's scary. But the bottom line is, what are you doing for yourself and for your family? Have you achieved on the level that you want to achieve at? Are you reaching financial freedom? Are you close? Are you getting there? Do you have a plan? Do you have a methodology? The problem is most people don't. Most real estate agents don't. And that comfort right. zone is what you need to jump out of. You need to get comfortable being uncomfortable. Because get comfortable being uncomfortable. <laughs> Preach, talk. Because otherwise, change is not going to come. If you keep doing what you've always done, you'll keep getting what you always got. And the bottom line is, if you're satisfied with what you've got and you're happy with it and you feel financial freedom is already at your fingertips, hey, stay where you are. We, we can still be friends. You can still come and visit the Wealthy Realtor Academy. I'll help you out all day long. But at the end of the day, if you aren't where you want to be and you haven't gotten to where you want to go and you don't have a path and a lane and a roadmap to it, we got a better, we got a better way. We got a better way. I'm wearing this rhino shirt and people, joke, they laugh about it. They say, they, they laugh about the rhino shirt and they say, sir, but why are you wearing a rhino shirt? But the thing is, is there's this fantastic book, this fantastic yes. book called The Barbarian Way. Right. success. Yes. And you know what I'm talking about because you know who Erwin Raphael McManus is. Yep. Um, and so he is a Christian, um, he is a Christian preacher. And he runs the Mosaic in Los Angeles. I'm not a Christian, but I always tell people I respect the hell out of Jesus. But what, what happens is rhinos are faster than squirrels. They could run at 30 miles an hour, but they are blind 31 feet out in front of them. But because they are about 2,000 pounds or over, and they have a giant horn on the tip of their nose, it doesn't matter what's at 31 feet. You better get out of the rhino's way. And so a rhino is called a crash. A group of rhinos are called a crash. Not because of what they're doing currently. Even if they're lounging in the mud, they're called a crash because of their potential. And what I'm telling you right now is at EXP, we're building a crash. We're building a group of barbarians, a group of people that make things happen that are sick of watching things happen because you are either at the table or you are on the menu. And unfortunately, a lot of predatory people have been saying that for a long time and have been preying on people for a long time. I'm here to tell you as a great collaborator like this man here, as somebody who genuinely loves other people, this change is happening. Whether you are with us or not, we are running at 30 miles an hour and it doesn't matter what's at 31 feet out because Darren Campbell's coming. That's right. That's right. And the funny thing is, once you see something and you know that's a great thing, you get your spider sense starts tingling. You know it. You know it. And when you hear it and you go, wait a minute, can I combine one, the greatest brokerage opportunity I've ever seen that's the most generous, two, that's right. a passive income producing model, three, participation in the ownership of the company and wait yeah. and wait ground floor opportunity early responder this is ground the the first day at netflix was only one day people the first day at exp is today check in with me and dave in a year if you've been watching things happen 
you're going to be looking at us way down the road. Your opportunity right. is today. The ground floor only happens once. You know, you could only buy Google stock on the first day one time. This is day one at EXP, people. And if you miss the train, we're going to be down the tracks, baby. We're going to be down the tracks. Now, you can either get on this train and ride with us or wave bye-bye. Because it's real estate. You want, like, it's you just a brand new day, day, Dave. Hey, it's the first day at Netflix. Like, right now, you get an opportunity. You get an opportunity. And it really, you either, you understand it or you don't. And that's one of those things that, like, I've heard people say, and they almost say it condescendingly, and it's not meant to be condescending, but you either get it, you want you once you see EXP, once you really understand it, and you've taken a moment to understand it, you either jump ship immediately, which is pretty much you did, yep. you start selling off all your franchises, which is what Mike Bjorkman did, you yep. start running to EXP because you see what the opportunity is. Or you sit back because you don't understand it or you are terrified of what is happening. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna start wrapping up some of these things. We have 135 reactions. 130 wow. comments live. Wow. Um, this has been absolutely fantastic. Um, so really quick, and we're gonna, people are jumping from everywhere. This isn't one of those things where it's like, just from the flat fee companies they're coming, or just from the Realogy companies on the terrible splits, they're coming from KW. They're coming from everywhere. So Catherine says, I was singing hallelujah, making the move from KW to EXP. And I didn't even fully understand what I was jumping into. No regrets. I didn't even completely revenue understand the revenue share until recently. Sitting there and reading it and understanding it, it you don't have to understand it right away. It is important to make the move or you're going to become one of those people who watch what happened. Um, yeah. This guy from Remax, Carlos Garcia, has a thumbs up. Hey, Carlos, people are selling off franchises, brother. You might want to head over here. Tyrone, <laughs> I would love to get Tyrone in, in our 52 crew, in our group that we're masterminding with. He says, I left my best friend, my broker, to join EXP. You're either making somebody else money or you're making you and your friends money or you and, you know, and the thing is, is I have people that are close to me that approached franchise owners and said, hey, you should come with me. I'm leaving and I'm going to EXP. And then they came with them. That has happened twice. It is in the works. Both of those are going to be very big announcements. Um, Dropbox. If you want to see the video right now, Rosie, Rosie's actually giving you the opportunity to download it. That's fantastic. Um, uh, EXP agents, all about growing together. We will see Darren in our production vision board in Shade Redondo Beach. Oh, you're going to be speaking of Redondo. I'm running the vision board, uh, moderating the vision board uh, procedure. We're going to build vision boards together. And the critical thing about that is, you know, every, I've made a vision board every year now for 27 straight years. And, really? Oh, man. And, the, and it's like magic, Dave. It's like the universe hears you when you, when, you, when you make it visual like that. And it's amazing how many of those things actually come to fruition because here's what I, I think happens. Here's the mystery. Yeah, talk to me. Because I'm a skeptic when it comes to vision boards for whatever reason. You gotta get over. You gotta get I've over. Never made a vision board. Because here's what's happening. Here's what I think the simple explanation is. Once you make a vision, because you think in pictures, you don't think in words. You think That's in right. pictures. And when you make a vision board, you put pictures of the things you most desire or the things that represent what you most desire on that vision board. But here's the magical part. When you do that, you actively choose the things you'd like to see happen in your life, and you make a visual of them, and you put it somewhere. Here's the magic. Those things go to work in your brain, whether you know it or not. Those things are working in your brain, whether you're asleep or awake. Those things become noticeable to your reticular activator, whether you acknowledge it or not. So here's the thing. A vision board puts the wheels in motion in here, and that motion never stops. Yes. And so, so what happens then is you become keenly aware whether consciously or unconsciously or subconsciously of the things that you that you desire most and you begin to gravitate toward those things and then the universe call that whatever you want pick a pick a word i don't care it could be religious it could be spiritual it could be yeah. it could be metaphysical i don't care those things start identifying themselves in your life those lanes start opening up in your life and that, my friend, is where providence happens. And the thing is, is understanding quantum physics, 
taking a, a moment to really understand that there are other people who are intelligent, that were called brilliant, that were called mad, that were burned at stakes. We're talking about this stuff a long time ago. The ancient Egyptians were talking about uh, your thoughts becoming things. And so this is nothing new, but people are uh, are actually absolutely rocking and rolling with it. So if you want to build a, a vision board with one of the best dudes in the industry, come out to uh, Redondo Beach. Sonia, if you could post the information for that link here in the comments, people I'm sure would love to come out and see you speak. Um, so this is awesome. Thank you, Stephen. Um, more leaders helping leaders. That's really what's going on with the XP. People are growing this together. This isn't the kind of thing to where we're saying, hey, come work under Darren. We're saying, come be a part of this with us. Come be a part of this with us. We want you here at the table. So if you're just tuning in, we're going to do a quick recap. We broke down how to make $350,000 a year by yeah. introducing people to Darren. We put up the algorithm out there. If you want to talk to Darren more about that, feel free to do that. We talked about meeting at the closing table at the Ritz-Carlton. We talked about, uh, which is also where we met Rosie. Um, we talked about uh, your everything that you stand on, but you're so humble about it, brother. I love you for that. Um, I'm like, you're the $4 billion man. You're like, Serpa, chill out a little bit, man. Like <laughs> people know, people know, but that's okay. You know, people don't care how much you know until they know how much you care. And you're one of those dudes that's a heart-centered dude, and I love you for that. Um, you're either somebody that makes something happen, you watch things happen, or you sit back and wonder, what happened? And that's what's going with EXP right now. Golden saying, hey, be our business partner. We don't want you to come follow us. We want you to come be a leader with us. Be a part of it with Sonia. Be a part of it with David. You've never experienced any – this is the event right here. If you want to go uh, hang out with Darren in Redondo Beach, these things, guys, you have never experienced a company like you will experience with EXP. Um, it is different. It is absolutely 100% collaborative because we all know that if you make money, we all make money. That's right. Darren Campbell, you want to break it down and sign off for us? We've been going for over an hour. We're coming up on an hour and a half. And this is one of those things, guys, if you're just watching right now, if you're just tuning in, this was phenomenal. This was absolutely electric. It's worth every minute. It is 100% better than most podcasts that you're going to listen to. And you could listen to it on your phone and watch this handsome man the whole time. Break it down for us, Dan Campbell. Let's sign off. All right. Well, I'll tell you this. Look, opportunity and preparation are where success happens right where we're, we're preparation and opportunity meet is where success happens now here we are at exp you've been preparing in your real estate career for however long it's been the opportunity called exp has just come along your ultimate success awaits now to give yourself the best opportunity shouldn't you go with the company that's offering you the best commission split the best opportunity to share equity and the best opportunity to create passive income while just doing what you already do there well, is doing what you already do. We're not asking you to sell herbal life. We're not asking you to sell herbal supplements. We're saying sell real estate and just tell people about EXP. That's it. That's it. And you know, it's um, you know, life, the, these opportunities, I'll tell you, life-changing opportunities, if you're fortunate, come around maybe four or five times in your entire life. And I'm gonna tell you, for a lot of people, this is the greatest life-changing opportunity from a career standpoint that you'll ever see. And so you sit position. So, with tell people about life changing for a second. Give me two seconds. Okay. Life changing opportunities. Again, they only come up every so often. And very rarely do you get the opportunity to be on the ground floor of anything. EXP is a new company that is just about to take off in a way that no one's ever seen. You know, there was a, once upon a time, I was a Remax uh, owner and we heard about this little company called Keller Williams. And we kind of chuckled. Okay, yeah, right. Another a, a Remax lookalike. And lo and behold, six, seven years later, they had 110,000 agents. Well, and, well, here is an opportunity with a company that has taken the best of all the models, the best of the Remax model, the best of the KW model, the best of the Century 21 Berkshire model, and has combined it and made a greater and even greater opportunity for you, the real estate agent, because they care about the real estate agent. They realize that if you prosper, the company prospers. If I, Deer and Campbell, help you achieve your goals, then I achieve my goals. So my objective is to help you, any of you that want to participate, achieve your greatest you, to become your best you that you can possibly be. And by default, I benefit from it.
So this is yeah. a golden opportunity. You got to take advantage of it. If you want to learn more from me, I'm Darren at DarrenCampbell.com. You can reach out anytime. My you interest is your on Facebook Right now, you're watching this on Facebook. You shoot Darren a message on Facebook. As simple as that. That's um, right. Honestly, Darren, this is a borderline religious experience. This is absolutely <laughs> fantastic. Catherine says, amen. Other <laughs> people are saying, amen. Uh, sell, sell, and win. Cap, cap, cap. And, of course, that cap is so low. Reynaldo said, thank you, Darren Campbell, for this opportunity in introducing me to Mr. Serpa at the Maya Hotel in Long Beach, riding with you. Reynaldo right. is in. Okay? He's in. He's in. Look at this. The guy with the re <laughs> the, the, the guy with the Remax Carlos. is saying, I'm coming, Rosie Rodriguez. I'm coming. And he has that right now as his profile picture. I'm telling you guys, there are people that are coming over right now that can't even tell you that they're coming over. You have no idea how quickly the flood is going to happen. Darren Campbell, I had no idea you were going to spend this much time with me to, this morning. I had no idea. I had to get coffee. I, I had to refill my coffee. I had to I had to stop and get a charger at one point. This was one of those things where I just didn't want to stop it. It was just that amazing. So um, thank you. My pleasure. It's my pleasure, Dave. I'm looking forward to helping a lot of people accomplish their goals and have a lot of fun along the way. That's what people say. Hey, it's exactly the best model. You guys are awesome. Thank you. Yes. Like a crash of rhinos. <laughs> well, Dave, I want to thank you for having me on the show. Uh, I'm looking forward to the, the, the next several years as being the greatest in our careers. And anybody that wants to play with us, just come on in. The water's fine. Right on, brother. I appreciate you. Darren Campbell, I'll let you go. I know you got things to do. I appreciate you for tuning in. Watch this one back from the beginning. It was phenomenal. Love you, brother. Thank Talk you, brother. Soon. Share it out. Share it out. Make it happen. We're taking over. Crash. <laughs>